Hi everybody. My microphone's really picking everything up, isn't it? Well, let's turn that down a little bit. How about now? That sounds a We'll put it back where it was. Maybe it's just because I have my headphones turned up so much. Oh, yeah, they were almost at max. All right. Um, well, so... I'm kind of talking to air right now because there's nobody watching, which is okay. Today's been kind of a rough day. I, uh... Sorry, I'm pulling up my, pulling up my stream on my iPad here so that I can go ahead and watch the, uh, watch the chat in case somebody comes in. Today's been kind of a rough day. Um, been a rough mental health day, I guess tell from my beautiful hair that I haven't showered. I got up, I put clean clothes on, I put deodorant on. That's probably... I brush my teeth. Half ass is better than no ass. Got to remember that. Uh, my dog woke me up at 7 o'clock or so. Whining. She's getting old. She's on a diet right now because the vet said she was overweight. And so she is very food motivated right now. So she woke me up at 7 o'clock and I told her to go back to bed. I'd feed her when I got up. And then my roommate got up and turned a bunch of lights on. Um... And I had a panic attack, uh, which is pretty fun. Um, my particular brand of generalized anxiety disorder mixed with bipolar 2 depression uh, manifests that my my most difficult to control panic attacks are screaming fits of rage and who oh boy it was a it was a struggle not to fly into one of those this morning uh, I took too much clonopin then to try and, because I couldn't get it broken. I'm out of the medical marijuana that I usually use, uh, that I would have supplemented the clonopin with. Um, and then I fell, fell back, I finally fell back asleep because, you know, somnolence from clonopin. And then I couldn't get up. And so I slept until about 3.45, 3.30. Woke up just in time to go watch uh, the part of the, part of the stream on the Opera Geeks channel about parasocial relationships and streaming. And as hard as I try to be a participatory part of communities 
listening to streams like that and hearing them say things like, uh, you know, you got to spend time to be aware. I don't know. It, I know it wasn't. This is just a manifestation of my panic, but it, I felt... Targeted. Even though I said nothing in the chat, and I know they weren't talking to me, I watched some of their, I watched many of their streams and try to participate in a meaningful way. Um, but I had to stop watching that, even though I really wanted to watch it because it was causing another panic attack, and I really should not take any more clonopin today. So, uh, instead, we're here, and I'm streaming with nobody in the chat being very open about my mental illness struggles today. Um... And we're maybe we're gonna we're gonna try and play some Skyrim. We're gonna see if we can uh, if we can do that, and hopefully hopefully we'll get at least a couple more streamers or a couple more watchers. Uh, I see one person watching. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're part of the community. I would like to create a community here. I have a Discord server that if I start getting more than two or three people watching me, I will share the Discord server so that people can join it. Um, but we're... We're going to be as chill as possible about playing Skyrim today because I really need to uh, make sure that I protect my own mental well-being. Uh, okay, can I... I wish that there was a way to turn on captions. Yeah, yeah, fine, whatever. Uh, okay, so let's go to this screen, and let's I don't know, okay, there we go. That looks better. Uh, I know it makes me a little bit bigger. Um, uh, I... Uh, I don't know. I need to find a way... Maybe to get my camera a little closer to my face. So that you don't see quite so... That's the wrong side. So you don't see quite so much of this stuff up here. That's just my door. It's my front door. My chair is facing the uh outward um the devil doors of my of my room of my living room here. I live in a one bedroom apartment with a roommate and so um I uh See, that's not what... Okay, hang on. Let's see. Ah, uh, there we go. There we go. Now we got it figured out. Um... Oh, I could put a border on it. Look at that. Look at this. All right. Let's uh let's see. 
let's see what kind of a border I want to put on there. Let's put a green border around it. And oh yeah, uh, we'll make it a little bit thicker so that it stands out. And we'll round it out there. That's what I wanted. Look at look at all these settings that I'm discovering here. Chroma key. Oh yeah, I don't need to do that. Okay. Uh, save. Look at that. Look at how beautiful my portrait looks now. I have a I have a border. It's cutting off my crazy hair. That's probably okay. Uh, but uh, let's fire up some Skyrim here. We're just gonna we're gonna talk. We're gonna be real chill today. We're gonna stream until I probably until I feel like going to bed. To be honest, get up every hour or so and do something. Feed the dog. Do the dishes. Something like that. Take a little bit of a break. Um, and we'll see how that goes. I'm still feeling like this rising panic in my stomach. It just keeps coming. Just keeps coming. Never stops. The the continuousness of uh, severe mental illness. Let's turn down the volume in the game in the game just a little bit here. Uh, yeah, there we go. The continuousness of of severe mental illness is uh, it's pretty overwhelming, pretty tiring. So last time we were here, I bought a horse, uh, and then the horse got killed almost immediately. Um, gal like you needs a war horse, I reckon. We let's see here. Only thing better than riding a swift horse is riding a swift horse over the enemy. Well, that's quite a thing to say, Skullvar Sablehilt. Looking to shatter records, or yeah. Let me buy a horse. So, got one all saddled. If you've got a deal, it's the one with the saddle. Ride strong. All right. Thank you very much. I have a horse now. Let's go. We have to ride to the camp in the Rift, which is straight south of Iverstead instead of over by Riften. So we're going to ride this way. Uh, yeah, no, but the... I don't know. It just... feels like it consumes your entire life and there are days that are days that are really hard um, toward the end of when I was working my last job uh, Uh, 
Um, just going to work was was a real challenge. Uh, I have chronic and constant migraines on top of the the mental illness, and so. Ooh, I hit my horse. Um. And I had a I had an intermittent FMLA allowance for the migraines, uh, but nothing for mental illness. And it was hard. Um, I was a salaried employee. Uh, and still working to meet my requirements every month, but struggling to spend 40 hours a week actually in the office. And they wouldn't let me work from home. And... I definitely had episodes of the, the seething, uncontrollable rage. One of them led to me sending an email to the head of human resources and the head, the CEO, president and CEO of the company saying, I demand to be paid for the, the work that I've done. Um... And that didn't go well for me. We had to have a meeting with HR and that was pretty unfortunate. But after that job ended, um, my con the, the project that was funding my position ended. And so I lost that job. Uh, and I ended up moving back, moving back to Iowa, where I live now, so that I could live with my parents. And I live, I live theoretically by myself, but um, I live next door to my parents, uh, and if that weren't the case, I think I probably oh, there's a dragon. Okay. Apparently the dragon didn't want to fight me. It's right there. Come here, buddy. too high up in the air I can't uh, I can't attack him <sighs> sorry for the yawns they're a signal that my body's having trouble with panic right now I'm sorry about that Uh, anyway, I moved back to Iowa, and I live with my parents now, and, or, not with them, I live by myself, but, 
if I I think if I didn't have them next door I would need to I would need to be in some sort of a some sort of an assisted living situation um, because I'm not really Um, I'm not really... Not really independent, you know? Um... I remember to take my pills most of the time. But not all the time, if I'm not reminded. I have trouble doing activities of daily living, like streaming helps uh, with uh, there's a bear, hi bear Bear is my friend, but I have to find my horse because he ran off away from the bear. There you are, horse. Uh, all right, uh, this way. I don't remember what killed my horse the last time. I think it was that bear. So I'm glad the horse didn't attack, didn't try to be part of that fight. Um. Yeah. It's uh. It's tough. When I got back to Iowa, I worked for a little while for Mod Squad, um, which was pretty cool. You get to pick your pick your own shifts when you work work for Mod Squad, uh, but it still was a a scheduled thing that I could never be sure that I was going to be able to do. And so I eventually got fired from Mod Squad. Um, which... <laughs> I'm famished. I better eat something. Um, and, you know, that was unfortunate, because I liked some of the work that I did, did for them. Uh, but at the same time, uh, it wasn't super unexpected. And... It's really a lot of work to get... a lot of work to take care of yourself uh, when you can't make any money. I should have had been having unemployment from California, but when I moved back to Iowa, it, uh, it got flagged as possible fraud, and so... I haven't gotten, or 
Or why are you attacking me? Prepare to die. Why? I don't want to die. He fell through the world. Oh, no, he didn't. There he is. Uh, oh, sorry. I flicked the... I need to get a new headset that doesn't have that, I suppose. Um... Oh, once again, a person who is too powerful for the spell. Where'd my horse go? Did you run all the way back here, horsey? Did you run up the mountain? Did you run up the path? Did you keep going along the path? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Horsey? Horsey? There is a group of bandits over here that we are going to go teach a lesson to because Telrav was trying to trap us by bringing us over here. We're going to save before we get up here. Do I have any magic potions? How much easier to rob when you're dead? That's all you got. I'll show you what a real. Ah! I'm not gonna make it. I thought I would be able to kill him. Where's the tar? Love a challenge. Uh, I'm not sure if that's. I missed. Gotta not miss. Yep. Okay. I I am bleeding. You are correct. God damn it, I missed again. Uh, okay. Take one of those, and one of those, 
And a couple of those. <laughs> I love a challenge. Tar, where are you? You think you can take me? I mean, no, I don't. I suppose I could unlock. Uh, I suppose. Oh, oh. I suppose I could unlock them both. I still don't know where my horse is. Thanks, Crimson. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. I'm just sitting here. Playing Skyrim, talking about mental health. Go over here and see. What they were protecting. Not much. A little bit of gold. Are there more bandits up here? Oh yeah, uh, this one, I don't know if I have any black soul gems, but we'll try it, a lesser soul gem.
Is that it? Just that one? Just the one bandit? Uh, I still don't know where my hired companion is. He is lost with my horse, apparently. I guess he's not really hired. I did a favor for him and then he agreed to follow me. There's a turned over cart over there. I guess we're walking the rest of the way to Iverson. We'll hit quick save again. Need something? Need something? All right, now everyone back away. Let the law handle this. But if anyone saw anything, step forward. Otherwise, step away from the body. You there. Is you there. Murderer? What do you know about this? Uh, I'm not answering any questions. Well, perhaps a night in jail might loosen your tongue. Hmm? Then perhaps you care to explain why you are standing so close to a dead body with your weapon drawn. Uh, I don't know what else to say. I didn't have anything to do with this. Hmm. You can go. You stay on your best behavior now. I've okay. got my eye on you. Sure you do. I have an Alakir uh, warrior as an ally now because I reanimated the body. It's night time and I don't like being caught out in... Caught out on the... What time is it? 8 p.m. Horse. Look at that. It's my horse. You got a long ways up the path, buddy. How did you get so far up the path? Uh, okay. Good job. I still don't see a tar, though. I gave him all that wonderful armor. Are we going to make it to Iverstead by nightfall? Wait a minute. That way is to rift in. This, oh, that's a bear. Let's kill the bear. Uh, sure. These damn bears are gonna kill my horse again. I know they are. It's going to be pretty late by the time we get to Iverstead, I think. Oh, an assassin!
Bear? Where'd my bear go? Come here, bear. What good is it to be a necromancer if the things that I resurrect don't help me? I'm tired. Yes, I am. I'm gonna have to sleep, I think. I think I'm gonna have to make camp and then uh, make my way to the Imperial encampment next, tomorrow morning. Oh no! My horse tried to die. Ran into some wolves. Come on. Actually, you know what we're going to do? We're going to make camp right here. I'm not in combat. Good, thank you. Uh, okay, let's uh, let's sleep. I know it won't be we'll get eight hours of sleep. We'll wake up at six o'clock. We'll be on the road. Feel better, but still drained. I'm warm, but I'm hungry. Let's eat some food. Still no atar. Uh. My imperial encampment is this way. Can I, can I ride straight across to it? Ooh, bandits. Your belly okay. Good job, horsey. Something to report? Whew. Uh, I am reporting for duty. You're going to Riften. My spies report the Jarl Steward Anuriel has arrangements with the Thieves Guild that would be rather embarrassing if made public. I need you to find evidence of her corrupt activities and use it to gain a measure of her cooperation. This will require stealth and discretion. 
The Jarl's guards won't take kindly to anyone rummaging through her steward's private quarters. I will get I the proof. You, yes, you can. Alright. Let's... It's kind of a long ride to Riften. But... dragon up there. Should we go up there and see the dragon? Can we get up there going this way? Is this the way? Seems like it. I wonder what word wall this is. Again, I should know all of these locations because I've played this game a lot, but I don't. this it's uh something okay okay I was like what I can't ride through the oh two ice wolves oh no God damn it, you killed my horse again. silver ore. Alright, we will get some of that. Around we go. Is the dragon over there? I 
don't see any dragons. I see an autumn watch tower. Should I should I be seeing dragons? Now oh, I see the word wall. Is it up this way? Oh, there is a dragon. Is he killing my is he killing my ice wolf? Did you kill my ice wolf? Yeah, I, I know. He's trying. Yeah. Ah! Uh, okay. Well, we killed the dragon that we weren't sure was there. I don't have a lot of... space. Uh, I think I can take one dragon bone, though. I sure wish I knew where a tar was. What's Alright, let's make another campsite here. Just so that I have a fire. And a box to sit on next to the fire. Uh, 
Uh, and then I'm gonna window out. And... I'm gonna look up Atar's uh, ID. Atar Skyrim. And we're gonna use console commands to summon him to us because uh, okay, so Zero zero one. Oh god, I can't read that. Even with my glasses on. Uh, I'm gonna move my microphone for a second so I can, like, get real close to my screen. Zero zero one nine eight B zero. Okay. Prid. Zero 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 one nine eight B zero. Move to player. God damn it, Atar! Why do you keep getting lost, buddy? Let's get going. Yeah. Well. Okay. I. What do you need to take? Hmm. All right, well, let's take the rest of the stuff off of the dragon and give it to Atar. What do you need to take? Let's go. And then we're going to go upstairs and get the word off of the word wall. Marked for death is a good one. I will take it. Oh. Atar, you're about to get an armor upgrade, my man. Once I get back downstairs. Boom. Boom. We've stopped. What is it? What do you need to take? Um, and then, yikes, uh, okay, lead on then, well, we're gonna just, uh, hey, here's a barrel, that's good. We are going to drop this steel armor right into that barrel. What time is that? It is 10.40 in the morning.
the dragon's crash landing here. I gotta go to Riften. Where am I? I don't have a horse anymore. Alright, well, let's run this way. Kill that saber cat. And then we will reanimate the saber cat. What? Am I? Oh, there's a bear. Go get him, saber cat. Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, we're going to stand here for a minute and let my magicka regenerate. Make a bear. We lost a tar again. There's something over here. What's this thing? Ah, Bethalft. Is this where we find... Okay. Now I really... I need to be going east. So I suppose we'll go... Oh, there's the road. This character isn't super good at stealth stuff because she doesn't really stealth so much as just a blast. So not sure how this one's gonna work, but we're gonna we're gonna try. There's a ooh, that's a that's an iron ore vein that I should probably pick up. There's a tomb of some kind right here. Go see what this tomb is. Probably a bandit hideout, because most of these things are oh, it's one of the It's one of the random ones that I have from an add-on that I will do if I'll do it if one of the radiant quests calls me to. Oh, jeez. That's not what I needed. I'll do it if one of the radiant quests calls me to do it, but otherwise, I'm definitely not going into one of those forgotten places. Today of all days. There's a giant spider up there. Starting to feel pretty okay.
Good job, bear. Starting to feel pretty okay. My stomach's still kind of in knots from my day so far. And it's not like it's not like I had it. nothing happened today. I think that's what I think maybe that's what people without mental illness don't necessarily understand so well is I'm on a pilgrimage to the shrine of Azura, the goddess of twilight. There's no way to predict um when you're going to have a good day or a bad day. It's just how well your brain manages to produce the right chemicals on a particular day or how many of the wrong chemicals it produces Atar what are you doing? You just standing there? You're just standing there. All right. Dwarven ruin up there. That forgotten dungeons add on uh, mod also adds a also adds dwarven ruins though, so it's tough to know whether I suppose the frostbite spider will be better than nothing. Um It's tough to know whether uh, the Dwarven Ruin that I see on the map as I run past it is one that I actually care about or whether it's just uh, an add-on one. Riften is this way. There's a, a something up there on the cliff. We're going to get to Riften and then I'm going to take like a a 10 minute break or so. My dog is begging for some attention and to be fed. Um, and we're almost to Riften. It's right over there. Uh, but no, I was saying, um, it, it, I, I think that people who don't suffer from severe mental illness, um, or like severe chronic illness don't necessarily understand or they think that their experience with it is universal and that's not it's not really how those things work like one of the um uh that is Aaron Goth's place one of the uh, one of the exchanges that I had with somebody at Mod Squad um, involved them saying, "Well, when I get a migraine, I always have plenty of warning, and I know ahead of time." And I mean that's great for you. I'm glad that you have plenty of warning, but I don't have plenty of warning. I uh 
I get migraines without warning. Hold and stand down. If you want to get into Riften, use the north gate. This one's closed. Why? My orders are to tell the riffraff to use the north gate. That's it. Uh, could you make an exception in my no. case? You can oh. use the north gate, or you can head to the next city. I guess I'm going to use the north gate. I'm going to run around Riften, and we're going to do the song and dance about uh, paying the visitor sacks. can never tell uh, you know when I wake up how bad the migraine is going to be today I have I, I mean I get one every day pretty much um, like right now when I get up I'm probably gonna when I take my break I'm probably gonna take one of my rescue drugs because I'm having a migraine right now um, that's, that's what's making it difficult to see uh on the screen hold there before i let you into riften you need to pay the visitors tax for the privilege of entering the city what does it matter all right keep your voice down you want everyone to hear you i'll let you in just let me unlock the gate Gates unlocked. You can head inside when you're ready. Okay. We will head inside. I had another run in with the Thieves Guild. Be careful, Leo. The Thieves Guild has made him Blackbriar at its back. Once We're gonna go fingers, so you could end up in stand over here. Where? Atar. Okay. Uh, I just don't want you to leave. All you right, really so that's happened to this city in a long time. Uh, we listened to Miol and Aaron's dialogue there. We skipped Mall. We'll go to Mall after a bit, but um, I'm gonna take a bit of a break first. So let me window out and. Uh, put up my be right back sign and some hold music for you. Wonder. This is our home. I'll be right back.
Sometimes getting closer to each other means getting farther away from your routine. Because the best memories are made when you learn something new. Like realizing fishing isn't about catching fish. Or vacation doesn't always mean going far away. It's about spending time with the people who matter most. Book the home that makes the vacation with Verbo. Grammarly helps make your writing clear and concise, no matter where you are. Compose a cover letter that stands out, thanks to flawless writing and compelling word choice. Inspire your team with a presentation free of errors in spelling, punctuation, and grammar. Impress your boss with a proposal that gets straight to the point. And be sure your writing comes across the way you intend. Download Grammarly today to review your writing before you hit send.
I'm back. We're just chatting for a little bit. Because I've got a bagel that I'm going to eat. I'm going to eat on stream like a monster. Oop, clang, sorry. That was a loud, probably very loud thing. I got my weighted blanket. I opened my door a bit so that I, I won't get too hot with my blanket on. That was also probably very loud for you, I'm sorry. I had to bring my desk a little closer. All right. I don't know you. You and Rifton looking for trouble? Yep. That's the wrong answer. Last thing the Blackbriars need around here is some troublemaker trying to steal a piece of the action. You can pretend not to hear me all you want, but you better stay out of the Blackbriars' business. Okay. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. When you borrowed the money, you said you'd pay it back on time and for double the usual fee. I know I did. But how was I to know the shipment would get robbed? Next time, keep your plans quieter, and nothing would have happened to it. What? Are you telling me you robbed it? Why? Why are you doing this to me? Look, Shadra, last warning. Pay up or else. All I care about is the gold. Everything else is your problem. Oh, I forgot my iPad. I can't see the chat anymore. We're doing uh, ASMR with the frog here. Huh? What do you want? I owe a great deal of money to someone and I think they cheated me. I don't know what to do. I was able to work out a deal with the stables in Whiterun to sell me some of their tack and harnesses. I borrowed some gold from Sapphire to pay for the shipment, but it got robbed before it even arrived. Now Sapphire wants her money back and if I don't pay her, I think she's going to kill me. You will? Oh, thank you. Be careful with Sapphire. She mixes with us. People of Riften, heed my words. Yeah, what's your problem? I knew that stupid kid would try and find a way to weasel out of his debt. Look, this is really simple. I lent him some gold, he promised to pay me back, and now he says he's broke. End of story. I don't care. A deal's a deal. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I've got the entire Thieves Guild at my back. What have you got? Don't know why you'd help a stranger like that. But a septum's a septum. Don't care where it comes from. You can tell Shadra his debt's been paid. I hope we bump into each other again. Uh, sure. Let us all sin in peace. If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up the seat. All right. Uh, okay. Fresh meat and produce. Get them before they're gone. How fast can you get your hand on the long bubble? A fairish portion. 
Never done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you carry. Hey, lass. I'm saying you've got the coin, but you didn't earn a septim of it honestly. I can tell. It's all about sizing up your mark, lass. The way they walk, what they're wearing. It's a dead giveaway. Look how you sniffed out my little scheme at the North Gate. You knew it was a shakedown, and you called him on it. That's what I'm talking about. Wealth is my business. Help me out, and I can add to yours. Would you like a taste? I've got a bit of an errand to perform, but I need an extra pair of hands. And in my line of work, extra hands are well paid. Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're gonna steal Medesi's silver ring from a strong box under his stand. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. There's someone that wants to see him put out of business permanently. That's all you need to know. Now, you tell me when you're ready, and we'll get started. Okay. Aye, that he was. And you sniffed him out because he broke one of the cardinal rules of our business. He got greedy. He was told to run the scam on merchants. But he smelled the gold on you, and his judgment went out the window. Actually, I admire how you handled the situation. You kept your cool and you didn't kill him. That's the mark of a professional thief. Okay. Sorry about that. Needed a snack. I don't like not being able to see my chat just in case somebody comes in and says something. Hello. Uh, I would like to be able to see it. Where is my iPad? Is it in the bathroom? It might still be in the bathroom. I am going to quickly AFK one more time and get my iPad so that I can see what's going on. Good thing I'm wearing pants today. I, uh, my iPad was just over on the kitchen counter. And, uh, I got over there just as I was, just as the stream showed that I was standing up. Good. Wait until I start the distraction, then show me what you're made of. Okay. Everyone, everyone, gather around. Steal the ring. 
And all the other stuff. Patience, Blanche. This is a rare opportunity. I wouldn't want you to get left out. That's what you said about the whisk message. And it turned out to be crushed nerve root mixed with water. Well, that was a simple misunderstanding. But this item is the real thing. Blood. Okay. You're not getting anything from me. is your disrespect for the loss of this land. It's time to face the Jarl's justice. Uh. Then pay with your blood. For the sons of Skyrim. All right. We're just going to save scum a little bit here. Never done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you carry. Hey, lass. You know... I'm saying you've got the coin. It's all of the way they walk. What they're wearing. Yeah, yeah. It's, look how you sniffed out my little scheme. Wealth is my business. Help. I've got a bit... And in my line of work, extra ha simple. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. There's someone that wants to see him. Now, you tell me when you're ready, and we'll get started. All right. Good. I'm ready. Wait until I start the distraction. Then show me what you're made of. Everyone. Everyone. Gather up. I have something amazing to show you All that right. demands your attention. Quick save. Then we're going to go over here, we're going to save scum, pickpocketing branch A. At five. Gems, potions, exotic ingredients, I have them all. Uh... New around Rifton? Take my advice. Stay at the B and Bob. Looks like I chose the right person for the job. Okay, apparently we got it go. that time. Your payment, just as I promised. How much do I get? The way things have been going around here, it's a relief that our plan went off without a hitch. A hundred gold. Nah, my organization's been having a run of bad luck, but I suppose that's just how it goes. But never mind that. You did the job, and you did it well. Best of all, there's more where that came from. If you think you can handle it. I can handle right it. Then. Let's put that to the test. But the question the is, can you handle me? A tavern called the Ragged Flagon. Get there in one piece, and we'll see if you really got what it takes. Okay. Working at the Riften Fishery is tough. I had to put some coin in but it put some coin in my pocket. Alright, we don't want to locate Brynjolf at the Ragged Flagon. We do want to go sneak into a Nuriel. Yes, my lady. That unpleasantness at Helden supposedly Take my advice. Let's see here. Don't it listen to that talk of the face sculptor down in the ragged flagon. This butcher is more like it from what I've heard. Yes, Martin. I've also taken a liberty. Good. If Rifton 
description. Ooh, and another backpack. Look at that. Alright. Tar, you're in my way, buddy. You're trespassing here. You Sorry, out. I'm out. Welcome to Mistvale Keep. Not here. Come with me. Stay close, and the guards will leave you alone. Okay. Welcome to Riftling, home of the Thieves Guild. Or so they'd have to believe. It's all lies. They're just thugs. Vermin. Creeping around the Red Way. I suppose you're here to extort something from me? Is that it? Well, what is it you want? It would ruin me. I have a good thing going here. The Jarl benefits from my more creative arrangements as well, though it'd be impossible for her to admit that. Layla is a simple and traditional woman, which makes it easy to manipulate her, but impossible to regain her graces once offended. Look, perhaps we could come to some kind of agreement? Could we? What kind of agreement did you have in mind? What if I told you about a large shipment of gold and weapons? Oh no, I'm no fool. You'll learn what you need to know once we've come to an agreement. Well, I... I suppose I'm not left much choice in the matter, am I? Nope. Very well. I trust a hefty purse of septums will suffice? Ah, it's a septum. All right, it's a deal. If you hurry, you'll catch them before they get far. It'll be a fairly slow moving oh. shipment is quite heavy and guarded Sorry, you scared me. Thank you. Now, let's pretend we never had this discussion. How are you? Okay. Come back. Maddie, come here. All right. Okay, thanks. Okay, bye. bye. Was my parents bringing Noah a box from outside the door? Uh, specifically, my mother. Now, my dog is whining because mom came and didn't take her with. To obey our laws. Okay. What is it? If you hurry, you'll be able to catch them. All right, we're going to hurry and catch them, even though it's evening time. I know, puppy. Can't believe my horse is dead. Well, uh, okay. So... Now, where do I need to go now? Report to leg at Ricka. Well, I guess we're running. Uh, we're going this way. 
back around to the south. We're going to pick up a, a road on the southern side. Uh, I might need to sleep. We're going to get as far as we can. And then set up camp. We're going to need to make some more campsites. Sir, some more camps soon. Um, but that's okay. We can do that. Here's the road. We're headed to Iverstead. What time is it? 7 p.m. We'll run until midnight and see, see where that lands us. Because, I mean, from Riften, it's pretty much straight west to, uh, to the, to the encampment we need to go to. Skyrim is really pretty. I love playing this game just for the vistas. Dusk falls and the sky turns orange. I don't have any appearance mods on. This is just the vanilla game. How it looks. In special edition. I could put appearance mods on that would make it look even better. I th I'm sure this computer would run them. Some wolves. Now I have a wolf friend. I know, wolf friend, I know. Is this an afflicted refugee? Are you finished, Ogleg and Grotesque? Why are there so many of you? There's a windmill down here, or a, a water mill, a lumber mill. Heartwood mill. Go cast your fancy magic someplace else. 